Hi guys, interesting email I received from a customer in South Australia today. It said, hi, Malky and Lone Star, testament to your product, GX1 with the CX415, pulled up five tires and broke them free from an artificial reef. Now this just goes to prove the point that I'm always trying to tell people when it comes to picking a Lone Star winch, the number one determining factor is what size and diameter of rope and chain you want to hold on your drum. It really has nothing to do with motor size. Motor size is in relation to drum size and the way that we build our winches. Not everyone, but the way we do it. And further to the point, and it's something that a lot of you guys may not know, the GX1 with a 600 watt motor and a full 200 millimeter drum actually pulls the same amount of weight as a GX2 with a 250 mil drum and a 1000 watt motor. The larger the drum, the larger the motor needs to be in order to spin that drum and pull weight when the load is further away from the axis. That's what it all comes down to. We don't make winches for light anchors and small boats. We make small winches that you could put on pretty much anything and you're not going to break them, but they're not going to hold the right rope and chain capacity on larger boats. That's how we build winches. This is testament to that fact, and that's how we've been building winches uh, since the release of our GX series in 2015.